guys and welcome to my autumn slash winter what is in my wardrobe I'm gonna go through my autumn slash winter wardrobe and tell you where my things are from and show them to you like most of them they're gonna be like a how it looks on me kind of clip not on all of them it would take me forever but I'm trying to do it on like most of them but I'm gonna tell you where everything is from because I often get like questions on my Instagram where's that from or whether where's this from or if I'm wearing it in a vlog or something else you ask me so I think I think <laughs> I think this is easier I did one in the springtime I don't know if you've seen it I'm gonna put a link down below if you haven't seen it maybe you, you want to know where my spring closet water were from um, but I'm gonna do one again today and I hope you are gonna like it. I remember that the last video I did with this was kind of just like, this is thrifted, this is thrifted. But I can just as well tell you that I haven't been thrifting much, much lately and every time I go and have a look I get so disappointed. So most of this is from like web shops or places where you can actually go get it yourself. But the first one here um, is a dress, a uh, midi dress from Boohoo and it has this bumper jacket over it because I really like to wear it with this bumper jacket and it's also from Boohoo so this is like a set from Boohoo and you're probably gonna realize this throughout the video but I really like Boohoo's items um, but I've been wearing this a ton throughout the summer but it's also really appropriate for autumn and winter both because of the pattern but also because it's long so I would wear it with tights uh, maybe not a bumper jacket but a cardigan or a warm coat instead but a really nice outfit and that is on my autumn rail just gonna close this because I'm not gonna talk about the dress I just want to show you this this is the next thing that I wanted to show you and it's this really really nice blouse from Made Kind. Um, I think or I believe I've shown you this in a favorites video but it's so soft and so beautiful. Just look at like the details on it. It's super beautiful. It's like green with orange yellow details. Uh, kind of golden actually and it's just perfect for fall. Like this is the perfect fall piece. Also just because it's so soft and it's like actually pretty warm. So quite an amazing piece. And yeah, from Made Kind. I'm gonna put all of the web shops down below. If I can find direct links, I will do so, but maybe it's not possible. This one is a big, like really warm, lovely poncho. Like it's so long, look at that. Um, and I love it so much. I had it last year as well and it's from a web shop called Kamala, I think it is. Kamala. Not completely sure about that, but it is something with like KA something. I'm gonna put a link down below. Uh, I have another puncher from them. It's gonna be the next one. I'm just gonna show you quickly. But these are so soft. Like, I know everything has been soft so far. <laughs> But I love soft things, but these are like so so soft and so warm. Um, I love to wear them also like on a cold summer day in the evening time um, with just a t-shirt underneath or a blouse or something and just wear this. Um, it's so comfortable and so beautiful and this is like so full. This is the next one and as I just told you, this is a shorter version. It's like the same like softness and warmness and everything and it also has a hoodie by the way, the other one has as well. But this is maybe more like a fall, fall, not fall, spring colour but I would wear that and I am going to be wearing that as well for autumn and winter and these two that I just showed you are some of my favourites. I've had this for two years and I still wear it once a week I think, like I love it so much. This is a beautiful kimono, not sure I've put it on this hanger the right way, but look at this kimono, it's a silky kimono, it's not warm, um, it's not like obviously an autumn item because it's not really warm, but just look at the colours and like the details on it, I think it's, it's, it could be an autumn piece. Um, 
but super pretty. You can see on the inside of this, I have just paired it with this Cory coloured dress. I don't know if it even goes well together, I haven't worn it like that. But it was just to show you this beautiful silk kimono. And once again, it's also, once again, I don't know. But this is also pretty long, um, from Make Kind. This poncho, crochet poncho, is also from Make Kind, and you can see it's like made all of, all of these small like pieces that have been put together um, in different like colors. It's really warm, like I've worn it once and it's super warm. And what is like kind of difficult about this is that I think it's too warm to wear it in indoor, but when you're outdoor you want to wear like a coat or something that hasn't like holes everywhere. So I don't really know when to wear it, um, to be honest, but it is a piece that I just like so much. Look at the tassels down here. Um, it's a bit short, but really cute. Uh, and I am going to figure out some, I don't know, some situation where I can wear it. Then I have this old dress from Boohoo that I've had for quite some time. I don't really remember when I bought it, so I might not be able to find it on the website and give you a direct link. But it's like, a, it's not a mini dress, but it's not a, maybe it's a midi, kind of a midi dress. And it has this awesome pattern. I think it's so fall and um, perfect for fall. And it's super comfortable to wear. It has these like long sleeves, which I think is a must when it comes to autumn and winter. And I just love all of the details on it. Um, it has been one of my favorites for a long time. I also wore it a lot throughout the summer. Um, yeah, really, really adorable piece from adorable. Is that a word? Am I confusing myself? Adorable. I'm confusing myself. But yeah, I think you've seen it before, but it's from Boohoo. Do you guys remember that I went to an award show in like, I think it's like two months ago? And I wore this dress at the award show and ever since that show, I've been wearing this like twice or three times like going out clubbing or meeting friends, partying and I think it's so beautiful and once again like it's a 70s fall kind of piece and this is from Soaked in Luxury it's called the fit of it is like really really flattering I think um, once again longer sleeves and it goes up like really high um, around your neck but a really really beautiful piece and it just has a really amazing fit um, I wore it out and one of my friends he was like you look really good tonight and it was just so cute because it's not something I often experience from people that I know like people I don't know can be like oh cool hair or something like that but it was so cute so I've been wearing that a ton for partying next one is this red maxi dress it's just completely red and it has this um, string that you can tie around your waist um, but I've been wearing that a few times as well already and I've been loving it so much it was a part of my haul video I did with my sister and um, it just has really really nice color for autumn because of this like dark red and it has a really flattering fit so this one is from Rumwe I think not completely sure, but I'm gonna put the link down below um, if I can find a direct link or just a link to the website. But a pretty like cheap dress, as I remembered, and really pretty. The only thrifted piece that's gonna be in this video is this. No, there's going to be two things. This is the only dress that I thrifted, and I've had that for three years, I think. I've had it for as long as I've had dreadlocks, pretty much, and. It's one of my favorite thrift finds ever. It was also in my favorite thrift finds video. And it has long sleeves, it goes up really high around the neck. The fit is amazing. It's a maxi dress, which is something you know I love. The colors are great. It's so like old school. I just love everything, like seriously everything about this dress. And as I've told you before, it was like when I found it, bought it and wore it, it was like, this is like made for me. It's like my dress, so. One of my favorites, all time favorites. So this dress is also like really retro. It's a maxi dress, it's like really long. Like this is really long. I can like step on it if I'm not careful. Um, but it has a really, really cool pattern. 
and I've been wearing that quite a few times as well. Um, yeah, there's not much to say. I don't remember where it's from though, but I am going to figure out for you. It was in a lookbook I did maybe last winter, maybe in the springtime. I'm gonna find a link if you like it, but it's really cute. Um, I do really like it. I tried to hurry up a little because I have four jackets uh, or coats that I just wanted to show you quickly um, but I don't want this video to be like way too long but this is the jacket that I really want to show you and I just talked to you about it in my uh, October favorites video and I just think it's so cool um, all of the details on it it's very like Indian I don't really know if that's what it is but to me it is and just look at all of the detail. It's so big and cozy and actually pretty warm. So, yeah, really been liking that. Then I would like to show you this jacket that was a part of that video as well. And it's this amazing green jacket with so many beautiful details on it. It looks so exclusive and it is. It is a bit of a more expensive jacket. Um, and both of these, also the one before, is from a group shop called The Cell or The Cell. Link below. But I love both of these so much. Um, this is a bit like close fit, so just be aware of that. If you want one of these, um, maybe alter it in a size bigger than you normally get. Because I can't, I, I can fit into this. It's size size medium but if I would be wearing something a bit thicker um, like a th thick blouse something under it it would be difficult to wear then I've decided to show you my DIY project my patch jacket and I made a video about how you can make a patch jacket like this one uh, if you haven't seen it but I really like it it's just a really dark grey denim jacket boyfriend size so it's like pretty oversized and then I've put patches on the back and if I want to add more in the future, I can, of course. But I think it's so awesome and really heavy. My arm is like sore. And I only have one jacket left and then I just have one bag that I'm just dying to show you once again. I don't know if you've seen it before, but maybe you have. But this jacket is also one of my all-time favorite things and it's thrifted. And I was so excited about around the time that I found it. It was also the first year I had dreadlocks, I think. And I loved thrifting at that point, went thrifting all of the time. I found this and I've just been loving it um, ever since because the colours are so matching my hair and my skin and everything. And it's so beautiful, so comfortable, a bit oversized and old school and I just, I just love it. And it's such a great like material and yeah. And the last thing is this bag that I just showed you in my favorites video as well. But it's from Hip Typico and I could just mention that over and over and over and over again. Maybe I'm just gonna bring it into every single video from now on. No, I won't. But this bag is just amazing and it's gonna be one of my favorites for, from the next like so many months. This is just going to be a favorite of mine. So, I don't know, some of you might be thinking, that's sponsored. It's not. <laughs> it has not been sponsored for just one single video. It's just me that I'm just so obsessed with that bag. I just want to show it to you again and again. I'm sorry if you're like really tired of that. I think this is like the fourth video it's in. So, I understand if you are, but those were all of my favorites and my autumn slash winter rail. There might be some new things over like the autumn and the winter season, um, but this is like the things that I have now that I wanted to show you and I love every single piece so much. Um, like nothing in this video was sponsored for me to tell you guys about. It's simply just items that I love. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a thumbs up. If you are happy that it's fall and winter, that's good. You could wear a lot of beautiful coats and I am excited about that as well. So thank you guys so so much for watching this video. I'll stop rambling and I'll see you soon. Bye guys.